Hello, and today we are going to um, learn how to make a gun shoot and then have the bullet shell come out. <coughs> so what I have here is a little guy walking around. He has a gun and so we're going to make the gun shoot and the bullet shell come out. And yeah, and we're going to make a target and hit the target so um this has nothing except like this is platform physics i have that in my tutorial and there's nothing yes nothing and nothing in the gun or this so how first we're going to make the bullet uh so just paint a little shell i mean not shell the yellow bullets so uh yeah uh just draw that uh mhm yeah, and we're gonna draw that, and that's our bullet. And now we're gonna code the bullet. So when the green flag is clicked, forever. If we click down, we want it. We want the gun to shoot. If a uh, mouse is down, so go to the sensing. Um, this mouse down, right here if mouse is down and we're gonna make a variable called cool time uh, yeah so. so after we shoot the gun we're going to wait like one second then we can shoot again so we'll set cool time to one second so you don't need to make a variable you can just wait one second but this is for making more guns but here i only have one gun and here wait oh no um uh and um so if the mouse is down <coughs> um so we're gonna make another variable which is ready to shoot to shoot and we're gonna make a, another sprite that has the cool time and waits after and so at the start we're gonna set the ready to shoot to one to one and so after if mouse is down I'm gonna add an and Uh, yeah, yeah and cool uh, ready to shoot equals one and now uh, we're gonna broadcast um, shoot okay so we're done with that we're gonna make another sprite this is also for the bullet and uh, we don't need to draw anything just leave it blank no, we don't want to see this and when clicked forever and uh, when I receive uh, what oh I didn't make a very broadcast shoot I'm pretty sure so now when we receive shoot uh <coughs> we're going to set ready to shoot to zero and wait cool time seconds so get cool time and wait cool time seconds and then 
we're gonna set ready to shoot to one again so we can shoot ready to shoot to one so uh now we don't need that and uh so let's try that no and we're going to repeat until so here and this ps this is my first tutorial in scratch 3.0 and has been a long time since i've done a tutorial so yeah um repeat until touching edge so touching edge move uh still uh, yeah 10 10 steps will be fine and then oh yeah wait no we need a clone so create a clone of myself here and here when i start as a clone we're gonna do that so let's try it oh yeah we have to go to sprite 3 this is not very like right it's it's really fast so i'm not going into lots of detail in this so um we're gonna go to sprite 3 here and let's try it. uh so let's move this guy uh-huh yeah and that seems like it works yeah yeah and we're just gonna do delete this call here okay now we're going to have the bullet shell come out and this might sound very simple but it is really kind of hard so yeah we're gonna make a new sprite again and this time we're gonna make it really small so maybe two and zoom in a lot and a uh, bit math and uh, no, not five two oh here just gonna change the color in the middle a bit and yeah so this is our shell uh maybe make it a bit darker because it's really hard to see right now and that looks okay yeah that looks fine so now we're going to code it and where's this oh there oh oh wait so um yeah let's yeah so first what we're gonna do is uh when i receive mess uh, when i receive uh shoot which is the message that we made and when i receive shoot i'm gonna we need to make a, create a clone of myself and um this one should hide yeah uh so hide mm. <coughs> so the clone when i start as a clone um oh wait uh uh so uh so basically what we're gonna do is um uh so uh, so um uh we're going to do um uh yeah so if when i start as a clone if uh 
if um so yeah, yeah we don't need that if and point towards mouse pointer and point towards the sprite 3 I mean go to sprite 3 which is the gun and move 7 yeah steps and mm, oh now we're gonna make a variable um speed y <laughs> and we're gonna set speed y to pick random so here 2 to 10 yeah uh, and if uh, actually, you know, um, repeat until, uh, so, here, oh, wait, here, repeat until touching edge, uh, change, uh, so, uh, here, what, no. Speed Y, and we're going to make a new variable, speed X, and um, change speed Y by uh, minus 1.5, minus 1.5. <coughs> And set speed x to um, speed x times 0 0.99. So times speed x 0 0.99. And change X by um, speed X, oh, of course, and change Y, uh, change Y by speed Y. And there's something that I forgot, which is here. Um, we need to set the speed x. To pick random. Minus 3 to 1. Minus 3 to minus 1. And then we're going to delete that call. So, so let's try that. Wait, I can't see. Hmm. Why is it not coming up? Oh yeah, we forgot to show it. Oh wait, we don't need point towards mouse point. Yeah, so that's what we need. Uh, let's go all the time. Oh, so yeah, now it's there. Um, and we're just gonna do the direction now. It's almost finished, and 
So we're going to do direction, point in direction. We want around like, since it's that, we want it pointing down. So maybe not too down, maybe 150. And then, oh, uh, let's see. I think, yeah. So I think that's done. And if we try that one more time. Let's just make it more visible. So maybe 300. Yeah, so if we just uh, do this again, minus 15. Oh no, maybe like that. Yeah, anyways, thanks for watching and please like and subscribe if you enjoyed the video or thought it was useful. And yeah, uh, see you next time. Bye.